hope you're ready for an exciting show. This is MMA Overdrive and Jasmine Chase is in the house. Once again, we have an episode that I know you'll enjoy. This week's show is some of the weirdest or most awkward interview moments in MMA. So let's get to it. Here we have fighter Quentin Rampage Jackson, who ended up humping his reporter during an interview. Dude, really? The reporter made a flirtatious remark and Quentin took it upon himself to start humping her while rolling and wouldn't even stop after she said cut. Things went from harmless to creepy in less than a minute. Who could forget Chuck Liddell on Good Morning Texas? His speech at times was so unintelligible it made Ozzy Osbourne seem like a Harvard linguist. Yeah, and so you, but when, remember the first time you stepped in the ring to fight like this? Because it's different than college wrestling. Oh yeah, it's a little different. It's a little louder, a little, a little, a little trashy. Okay, uh, the movie 300, you've seen it, and you're out to promote the film right now, right? You okay, Chuck? Yeah, I'm okay. Chuck started out okay, but by the end of the interview, all the morning host could say was, may the force be with you. Almost as if he was talking to some space alien. And all Chuck could muster was, I'm working on it. Get some sleep, Chuck, or put the qualudes down. And finally, let's wrap things up with Nick Diaz in an interview with Ariel Hawani. You know, I wasn't going to do this interview, but they told me I had to. So, you know, I feel good. I'm ready to fight. And, uh... I don't know. That's I don't have much to say. You know. Something against me? Do you not like me, Nick? I, I feel like you instigate fights quite a bit, but uh, you know that's fights between the fighters. Yeah, I mean maybe that's your, that's your job, but where I come from, you know, people like that get slapped. Wow, that was nice, Nick. It's okay to think it, but who actually is rude enough to say that? Nick did his best to make Ariel feel uncomfortable in the beginning, and we should all have a dime for every time he uttered the words, you know. Definitely not one of the best moments for either of them. Can you guys recall any awkward interviews? Send them in for review, and just maybe we'll do another episode on awkward media moments. Until then, keep well, my friends. I'm your host, Jasmine Chase, on MMA Overdrive.